Let's unbox the brand new M12 fuel hammer drill and impact driver power state kit. When it comes to the looks of these tools, they actually are a very good design compared to the previous model. The impact driver and this hammer drill are a major step forward for Milwaukee, especially with the power state technology. First, this video coming up in the future of the previous model, so please subscribe to the channel. Simply in the kit, we got the instructions, warranty, and catalog. We have the standard M12 charger. I am gonna to try to win whatever you could win. Video coming up. It comes with the standard four amp hour battery, a standard two amp hour battery. And of course, let's start off with the brand new Power State hammer drill. Model number is 3404-20, 12 volt tool, $220 as a, as a kit, 400 inch pounds of torque, 1550 RPM, and 22,500 beats per minute, and a five year warranty. First, let's do a concrete test. Battery is full, it's on speed two. This is five and 30 seconds of drill bit. All right, and if you're not familiar with the channel, my name is Dave Nicholas, so this is Man Cave Tools. And one thing I love to do is I love to test the tools out right out of the box and seeing how well these perform. First video I do of tools really does break these tools in. These tools usually perform better on the second or third video. 42.50 seconds. That new Hilti Neuron vacuum is actually awesome. I use this to, uh, to suck up all the concrete dust because it stays within that vacuum. Next, let's do a half inch concrete drill bit. These are box bits, by the way. We're gonna do a pre, we are going to use the same hole that we used for the five and 30 seconds. We're just pretty much gonna be used as a pre-drill. So let's see how well this does. Now remember, this is a 12 volt tool, you guys. The fact that it's even doing a half inch concrete drill bit is amazing. And this is the part where I say this tool needs to be broken in because it is straight out of the box doing a very hard task. And because of the fact, I don't judge these tools right out of the box. Not too shabby, you ask me. It's not done yet though. Cleaning this up gives the tool a little break because this is its first video and it also lets me know how far it actually went. Needs a little bit more to go, so we'll continue the timer. Fifty four point eighty one seconds. Not too shabby. It'll do better with a different battery and it's one hundred and twenty degrees from doing two holes. We have three bars left on the four amp hour battery. Let's do a couple of hard tasks with this uh, two by four. We are going to do a one inch spade bit first. We're going to do this on speed one. Let's see how well this actually does. Time, 4.10 seconds. Not too shabby for speed one. All right, since it did that with flying colors, let's move on to a one and a quarter inch speed bore. Let's see how well this 12 volt tool does with this. Speed one. Let's see how well this does. It's doing it up 3.97 seconds. The fact that it did it is amazing. These new M12 Power State tools are fantastic. Next, let's do a one and a half inch spade bit on speed one. Let's see how well this does. 4.35 seconds, not too shabby. It did it, it gets caught on the bottom, you guys. It, it just gets caught, it finished it. Let's do all that on speed two and let's see how well these actually do. It did at 1.83 seconds, wow. wow. Speed two, not too shabby. Now the, this is a hard task for speed two for a lot of 18 volt tools. Let's see in how well a 12 volt tool does. 2.36 seconds, oh just gosh. the fact that it did it is amazing. It That's with a four amp hour battery. I'm pretty sure it'll do better with a six amp it hour battery. Inch, uh, it did it though. That's seriously two. impressive. Let's do that again. And this is where it comes to where the tool needs to be broken in. Uh, it glitched out a little bit. It just uh, it, it just happens during the, its first video. All most most tools glitch out because I'm overworking the motor as a brand new motor, and it's it needs to be broken in. It's flashing, but it's okay. It's the first video. Yeah, I'm not sure what's happening. 
the tool is really hot right now and it, it just needs it needs a little bit of time to relax so it's not a big deal that it's doing this in its first video so please don't judge it you guys all tools need to be broken in it's at battery the 400 hour battery is at two bars it's overheating all right i want to try that again i want to see if i can repeat that And like I said, you guys, this is why I break these tools in. The first video is usually what I need to do to get the issues taken care of. All right, next, let's do the new Milwaukee Power State M12 impact driver. Now, this one's a beaut. Look at that. It is seriously such a gorgeous tool. Try LED beams in the front. It has four speed settings. Self-tapping mode one, two, and three. The model number for this is 3530-20. It is a 12-volt tool, $229 as a kit, 1,500 inch-pounds of torque, 3,600 RPM, and 4,000 impacts per minute, and Milwaukee's five-year warranty. Two-amp-hour battery. Battery is full. It is on speed three. Let's do a six-inch specs and see how well this does. Now, remember, this is a two-amp-hour battery, and the output of two-amp-hour batteries is not that great. But this one did 31.31 seconds with a two amp hour battery. There's no reason for it. There's no need for a graph in this video, you guys. All right, so let's take this out with the two amp hour battery. Four point sixty seconds. Not too shabby. All right, let's see it now. Instead of the four amp hour, I want to test out the six amp hour. I seriously want to see on how well this does. Battery is full. What a difference, you guys. What a difference. 4.37 seconds. Difference. Now compare that to the 31.31 seconds. Big difference. Not too shabby. 2.25 seconds. All right, now let's do a 4 and 5 inch by 3 eighths inch lags. We're using the 6 amp hour battery. Seven point sixty-two seconds. I got to reverse that out a little bit. It would dug a bit too too deep. All right, let's do the five inch. Yeah, that, that six amp hour battery is actually amazing. It is the M twelve six amp hour battery is worth getting, you guys. Twelve point thirteen seconds. Not too shabby. All right, let's take out the four inch. That M12 impact driver is like, it looks so cool. It does. It looks, look at that. It's amazing. 3.47 seconds. Not too shabby, if you ask me. All right, now let's take a closer look at these. Let's just compare the older models to the previous models. We are doing a versus video in the future, in the very near future, you guys. So please subscribe to the channel. Seriously, want to see what the difference is between these two hammer drills if and let you guys know if it's worth the upgrade. The new Power State brushless hammer drill is actually shorter. Look at that new impact driver. It's amazing. It's amazing. Has a tri LED beams on the front too. Side by side comparison. See, it's really not that much smaller, you guys, but it's I love that new impact driver. It's nice. And it is a quick insert collet. Right, so as you guys can see that when it comes to the first time using a brand new tool, it needs to be broken in. M12 glitched out a little bit, but that's probably not going to happen after the tool is properly broken in. I'm going to use the tools a little bit more before I actually do a versus video, but a versus video is coming up within the next couple of days between the older version and the newer version. I love the design of the new tools. Are the new tools better than the previous model? I am not sure, but we will find out. So please subscribe to the channel for that. And if you found this video helpful and entertaining, please like this video. Please hit the bell button to be notified of future videos and please subscribe to the channel. This is Dave Nicholas. Thank you for tuning in. I'll see you guys next time.